So we're in hell now. Uh, hmm. Now, you're a cute boy. I wonder what's underneath that shirt of yours. You're... Lost. Gotcha. Did, did I do it? Okay, there's Pokemon here. Oh, Gengar. Well, that's, uh... That's about right. It is hell. I don't really need a Gengar, though, so run and put some repels on. Repel. Not ether. Not steel excite. Lix repel. There we go. Alrighty. Coin... Coin Noma? When I died, I was told that I had lingering feelings to the human world. Due to this, I can never reincarnate because I never officially accepted my death. However, if I kill you here, I can take over your body. I want to leave this place. Well, too bad. You're an idiot. Just a flat out idiot. Do I, do I collect you? No, I don't want to stay here anymore. Nope, I don't collect you. Alright. Hmm. What's this? Nothing. Alright. I can see a terrible fate awaits you. If I am you, I would stay away from Mount Moon. Hmm. Oh man, what a drag. I'm too lazy to do this. Sloth. Boy, that's hard to guess. These are just brain teasers right here. Super difficult. Hmm. Interesting little path here. Bite me! Nope. This food is delicious. I wonder what that one is. What me? Super difficult. Super difficult. What else is left? Vandy, something, something, and something. Hmm. Yes. Can I walk off the path here anyway? What the hell do you want? Fuck off. Greed, envy, sloth, wrath. Yes. Hello. I, I can't even pronounce that. I'm a Futabi. Go and send men... What, what is... What is even this? What is this even? Waga, Nama, Tashimi, Anada, Yoseke, Kateke, Surigai, Kuraseo... Nothing. You you have nothing to say after that. Just okay. Whatever. I don't care. <sighs> Show me the last two. All right. Last two. Yo. I want more blood. I have to have more blood. Greed. I'm guessing greed. Yes. Is that everybody? I think that's everybody. Dracula. Can I get the Dracula? I want to get the Dracula. Hmm. Alright, well, let's get back there. I think I have the... I think I have all the people. I think I do. Okay. Where did I drop down from? Ah. Can I put... Can I put it in there, or what? No? I need the six simple spirits to start the ritual. I think I have them. Yes? No? Maybe? Do I not have them? Hmm. Yes. Do I only have five? Maybe you? It's not fair that I'm stuck here while you have the chance to live again. Why can't I be like you? Envy. Bingo! Okay, I think that's six. That has to be six. Right? Yes. Perfect! This is exactly what I needed. Now let's commence the ritual. I offer the six spirits. Greed, lust, envy, gluttony, wrath, and sloth. Now. Pretty. Subit wo nisho taco no miko yo inishi no kujutsu ni you're right. I'm a Yamagari Gishiki Shoken Kurenseo Sensen Jutsuki Teratari Huff Huff Now we just need the last ingredient What last ingredient? The blood of pride Where can I get 
What can I find pride? <laughs> You've lied to me. You were part of the other occult group. Actually, I didn't... I'm not part of them. I'm not trying to awaken the god. I have my own plans. Now surrender yourself. No. Got nothing to say, Nigel? Alright. Ugh. My plans. Huh? Big boss. Let's go. Hello. I can help you Pokemon with learning their moves. Okay. What can Lugia be learning? Whirlwind, Red Ball, Dragon Pulse would be decent. Extra Sensory. Aero Blast. Aero Blast is great. Why not? Yes. Let's get rid of each power. Sweet. Yeah. Can Charizard learn anything special? Shadow Claw, you can learn Shadow Claw. Dragon Rage, no fire thing. Flame Burst, eh. Wing Attack, might be good. 60, eh. Eh, I'm good. Yeah, I said, yeah, give up, give up. There you go, thank you. That'll do. Arrow Blast is good enough for me. What? You shouldn't be here. You're supposed to be the boy who awakens a dark god. Ooh. No! No! Yes. Yes. Next. YOLO! Our dark god is said to be a fearsome being that once fought the moon. Sounds like a smart god. <laughs> I need to heal slightly up. Just a bit. A tad. Where's my shit? Vive. B no, no. Pikachu. Oh, okay. I was on Pikachu. Alright. And restore. Ooh. Slowly heal all the way up. Slowly. There we go. There we go. Hmm. Hello. Our dark god is actually awake, but he is imprisoned by the moon. Okay. I just want to say you people sound super sane, and yeah, have fun with your lives. You don't have much time left, boy. Stay here any longer, and you'll die. Then why are you stopping me? I'm stopping you because you are needed for a ritual, so you can die. Duh. We can't start a ritual without your blood. Yay? Underworld. Huh? We finally got you. I can't move. You bit you're being held in place by our blood infused with our magic. Now you can't move at all, can't you? I need to get out of here. Usually, our magical old one had the power to hold a living person down, but you've been healed long enough. You're starting to lose energy, am I right, boy? You little piece of... Piece of fucking shit! Don't fault us for this. We're just like you. We just want to get out of this realm. You want to get out of this realm so badly that you're willing to end another person's life? Yes! Tch. Enough talk. Time to drain every ounce of, your bl of blood from your body. I think maybe bisecting you like a black Goliath? No! Help! Help! Ah! Green! Blue! Are you guys... Of course we're still alive. But not for long, Red. You gotta stop Porygon now. Yeah, but aren't you gonna help me? <laughs> Sweetie, we can't. Blue and I were stuck in this realm for way too long. We don't have much energy left to fight. We used our last remaining energy to defeat those two twits. Uh, you can't say twats. Come on. You gotta do this yourself, Red. Our lives rest entirely in your hands. Uh, I can do this, I can do this, I can do this! I'm going to fully get my Pokemon battle ready before I do this. Let's, uh... Max Revive. 
important for you, Pikachu. Everybody's getting battle ready. Everybody. Five. Good. Let's get some ether going on. Max Alexa works too. Perfect. All right. Let's fight. Why? Yes. Thank God for repel. Hello. Ah. No, you ruined it. Ah. He's still glitching up again. Finish him, Red. Finish him. Why? I think one surf will kill you. Hey, crazy eyes. How you doing, buddy? Boof. I think you're going down, crazy eyes. Yep. Easy peasy. Puff, puff. Puff, puff. Ah. Hey, it's missing now. What the hell is that? It's missing now. Cough. Bunch of noises. The glitch has probably ruined its wireframe. I kind of want to capture it. It's fucking missing now. I gotta admit, I've never seen a missing though in a Pokemon round hack. That's clever. That's original. I applaud you. I applaud you, sir. Oh, it's got a lot of HP. Fuck me. Okay. Don't have leftovers, don't have... Okay, good. Boop. It's got a shit ton of HP. Aerith signal. That's new. And it hits. Hits a lot. Hmm. That's not good. Surf. You got this, Polyrath. You got this. Shit, I'm dead. Yep. That's killing you. Oh well. No oh, Enderquip. Yay. Alright, well that was not good. Uh, we can take him on. Lugia is probably my next most powerful. I think Aeris is probably gonna fuck me up because it's probably gonna be like a bug type move, but oh well. Let's try. Necromancy. Ow, ow, ow. Jesus Christ. Well, that's perfect. Shit. Pika. It's all on you, Pikachu. Please don't have full restore. Please don't have full restore. Please don't have full restore. Thank God. Pika power. Get him. Yes. We did it. Puff, puff. Puff, puff. Pass, pass. It's too strong. I, I beat it. Bzz, bzz, bzz. What's happening? A Pikachu? No way, you're Ash's Pokemon. What? I never thought I'd see my true form again. So, Porygon was Ash's Pikachu all this time? How does that even work? I'll tell you how. When I started my journey with Ash, I hear the kid's gut. Guessing its guts, he was so naive, pathetic, and too mushy for my taste. I knew from the start that he was one of those childish trainers who would give up the moment things got tough. But I was wrong. Don't get me wrong, he was naive, pathetic, and mushy. But he never gave up. In the Viridian City Pokemon Center, when Team Rocket attacked us, he gave his all to protect me. In turn, I didn't give up protecting him. Unfortunately, I died from that incident. I realized I misjudged the boy, but it was too late. The shock from my death placed him in a deep coma. Sniff, sniff. During that time of death, uh, during the time of my death, Silphco was creating the first artificial Pokemon, Poygon. 
They wanted to create a Pokemon that can express true emotions. To do this, they've created a hardware called SoulNet. SoulNet can transfer a pre-existing soul of a deceased Pokemon into an AI file. My soul was downloaded into a disk, and was installed in the very first Poyon. However, due to the unforeseen glitches of the SoulNet hardware, I was given powers that rival that of a legendary Pokemon. Obviously, the scientists were scared, and locked me up. That was until I released... I was released by the three of you, when you destroyed the Sylphco building. Then why did you do all this? Why didn't you just reunite with your trainer? Because I wanted to pay back- I want to pay back for everything he had ever done for me. I have so much power, but even I can't release a person from their mind. Hmm? I was a horrible Pokemon. I didn't deserve a trainer like your son. I had to wake him up from his coma, or keep his memories alive. Everything was working fine, he made friends, and he was happy. Was that why you didn't hurt me in the beginning? Because I was Ash's only friend? Yes. But there's a problem. I don't have enough power. The real Ash is slowly dying in the hospital bed. I couldn't keep up the illusion. And that is why I started looking, looking, draining the life energy from anyone. I see. Ugh. But that wasn't enough, was it? No. Even after absorbing people's life energy, or evolving, I still can't prevent them from dying. That's when I remembered about the SoulNet hardware. I wanted to upload the entire universe into the internet. That way, I can keep Ash's memories and spirit alive forever. But I failed. Just let it go. Let it go. No, I'm not singing that. Huh? Mrs. Ketchum! I understand where you're coming from. I have lost love in life. I lost love in my life. And the thought of losing my son was too much for me as well. However, when Ash ended his life... Ended his own life. When Ash ended his own life shows that he does not want any of this to happen. Grammar. Sniff, sniff. What? Blue! <gasps> Green? Uh-oh. It's okay, they're whooping back to the real world. You'll be back there shortly, too. What's gonna happen to you? My poor Yon's wireframe has been destroyed. My spirit can no longer venture into the human world. This is the last time I'll ever see you guys. Goodbye. If you ever see Ash again, please tell him I'm proud of him. <laughs> you failed. I may have failed, but I gained something in the end. Let me guess. Love. No. Closure. That's something you're not familiar with. You can't use me as a pawn anymore. I never counted on you anyway. There's still that girl left in the human world. What's her name again? Alright. Carly. <laughs> your plans aren't gonna work. Dark Rye. We'll see about that. I will get out of this dimension. Ooh. Also, it's not Dark Rye, it's Dark Rye, but you're missing an all there. Two weeks later. You're lost. Uh, you've lost. Zero Genai Katsuda! Kalima! Kalima! How does it feel to be alive again? Not even remotely funny. You never laugh at anything. The Orange Cup is starting in two weeks. Really? You're pathetic. It's at Pumalo Island. I'll see you there, Red. You better bring your A game, Red. I'm not planning to lose to you again. Deal! Or no deal. Oh. Really? This Enigma Berry can raise my Pokemon stats to level 100? <laughs> Tee! Yes, I'm gonna sell to you for $5,000. That's a bit expensive. Hmm, okay then. I guess I'll sell to the next shop owner in Tangelo Island. Wait, I'll take it. Tee! <laughs> Thank you. Glad to be doing business with you. <laughs> I see you. Oh, hi, sweetie. Are you here to say goodbye? I guess you're going back to your old ways again. <laughs> I need money to survive too, you know. Whatever. Anyway, the Orange Cup is starting in two weeks. Are you going to take part in the championship? Nope. What? You're not? Sweetie, I'm not like you. The champion title doesn't really hold any place in my heart. Goodbye, Red. We won't be seeing each other for a very long time. Where are you going? I'm going to leave for Naomi. The Na Naomi? Pretty sure that's not the name of it, Region. I hear it's a paradise there. Oh, good luck, Green. How you feeling, Red? Ah, how you feeling, Professor Ivy? Much better, Red. Thanks for asking. How have you been enjoying your stay in the Orange Archipelago? I gotta say, it's pretty interesting. There's so many Pokemon in here that... There's so many Pokemon here that doesn't exist in Kanto, Grammar. 
Yeah, the orange rock Apollo goat is, is, uni ah, is unique like that. I'm just excited about the orange cup. <laughs> Alright, I forgot that you were here to take part in the orange cup. You're gonna be great. I'm rooting for you. <laughs> Thank you, Professor Ivy. Yay! Oh, it's you. Mrs. Ketchum, hey. Oh, hello, Red. What are you doing here? I'm just here to apologize, Professor Ivy. It was my fault that she was hurt. I'm sorry about Ash, Mrs. Ketchum. It's okay, it's not your fault. Even though the Ash I saw again is just a projection created by Poygon from Ash's memories. He was the son I have known and loved. Seeing him and hearing what he wants is what I need to finally move on. Are you going to head back to Kanto? No, nope, I'm going to leave Kanto. I'm moving to the Kalos region. I'm going to live with my sister and her family for a while. Oh, okay. I wish you all the best, Mrs. Ketchum. Goodbye, Red. Huh. So, is that the end of the game, or what is this Pomelo Island place? My Pokemon healed up. No, they are not. No, they are not. Yes, just please heal. I'm guessing Pomelo Island is west of Tangelo Island. Which I'm going to now. I mean, I've only been recording for 25 minutes. I can't... I'm not done yet. Yes. Tangelo, please. Oh, Kumquat. Kumquat's the place I gotta go. 